Hi everyone, welcome back to Bougie Doll Life. Today, we're going to be joining a tag with my reborn doll right here, Mia. And I'm going to be joining Leisha from Binkies and Blinkies Nursery. And I'm also going to be joining Lisa's Little and Tamara at Once Upon a Nursery. So today, I am gonna be changing my little Mia. So I was like, why not join and answer some fun questions? So the outfit I'm going to be putting on her today is this outfit that I got from TJ Maxx. It is a set, but I'm not gonna put the shirt on her, but isn't this the cutest? This is a zero to three months, and it's by this brand right here. Turn me around, baby. And then it has a headband, and it has some sockies, and then it has these pants right here. I really love the onesie, it's super cute. We're not gonna put this onesie on today because it looks a little dressed up, and she's going to be in the house today, so we're going to just put this onesie with those pants and the headband. So let's go ahead and get straight into the question. So before I get into the questions, Mia is a replica of Twin A from Bonnie Brown, and I got her off of Amazon. She is an Amazon replica baby, and she's so cute, and I absolutely love her. She has a cloth body. For now, I really like her. I do want to add a little bit of weight to her, so that's going to be coming soon. And she is getting a sibling soon, which I am so excited to show that to you guys. So let's go ahead and get her dressed and answer these questions. So the first question is first and middle name. So my name is Katrina, and my middle name is Shadron and it's spelled S-H-A-A-D-R-O-N. So that's my first and middle name. And it also acts as for nicknames. So my nickname in my family, people call me Trina. Most of my family calls me Trina. My mom, when she was alive, she would call me Tree. And she would call me all types of little names like Lick Tootie and things like that. And little tiny names because I was always small when I was young, so I would have little names. My uncle used to call me Tree Tree. And yeah, I had a lot of nicknames growing up. My aunt would call me Tinkerbell. And yeah, I had a lot of nicknames growing up. So the next question is, so the next question is month and day that you were born. I was born October 14th, 1992. So I am 30 years old and I'm turning 31 this year. So super excited, new chapter in my life, my 30s, and I absolutely love it. So the next question is, the next question is natural hair color. So my natural hair color is a dark brown. So my hair is not jet black originally, it is a dark brown. And well, it was a light brown when I was a little girl, but then it got darker when I got older. And right now I dye my hair honey blonde. I'll put a picture in the corner of the screen if you guys never seen me before and it's your first time seeing me on this channel. My hair is dyed honey blonde and I have locks. Recently, I've had locks now for almost this year, going on two years, and I really love having locks and I think it's so beautiful. And the next question that they have is, then they were asking, what is your eye color? And my eye color is brown, but in the like when you look at me inside of like bright light, it does show a little hint of like a lighter brown. My mom told me from when I was young that my eyes were lighter, but um, yeah, my eyes are brown. So the next question that they had was, the next question is, how tall are you? So I'm a little one. I'm actually the shortest cousin of my whole family. I am one of 11 grandchildren in my family. And I am five, between, I'm five, one point five. <laughs> I always put that point five because you know, some people say I'm five two, but really I'm five one and point five. But yeah, that's how tall I am. I'm a, a little girl. I'm really small. <laughs> so the next question that they had was what is your shoe size and I wear a size seven and seven and a half and if I'm wearing sneakers and it's boy size I will get a six 
or a six and a half but most of the time in women i wear a seven or a seven and a half i have really small feet <laughs> So the next question they had is, do you have any siblings? And yes, I do. I have an older sister named Kashana. She lives in Georgia. I love her so much. She watches my videos. Hi, Kashana, if you're watching this video. And then I have a younger sister named Kayla that she, me and her are two years apart. So right now I believe she's 28. And, um, and my older sister, she is, cause I am 30 turning 31. So she's 37, I believe 37 and she's about to turn 38. So we're seven years apart. And the next question was, did I have any pets growing up? So when my parents were together, they did have a dog, but I was never able to see the dog because before I was born, the dog passed away, I believe, but my sister did have a dog growing up. And then my dad had some dogs that were his when I would go over to his house or when I did stay with my dad, I did see my dad with a couple dogs. They passed on, unfortunately, but I never had personal pets. And oh wait, no, I, do, I did have a dog named Simba, um, probably like two years ago. And he was the cutest little bulldog and he was so cute. And he had the most gorgeous eyes and he was a retinous pit bull. And he passed away in surgery when he was just a puppy. So that was the pets that I've had so far. But I would like to have a cat and probably fish. So the next question they have is, so they followed up with the next question of, I'm putting some baby powder just to give her that baby smell. I do want to put one of those baby powder little tablets inside of her when I add weight to her. Or I'll probably put some scented stuffing inside of her once I modify her. But yeah, my favorite animal is, is a cheetah. I like how cheetahs look. My mom used to love cheetahs too when she was alive. She used to love that. And then... Also, my favorite, I want a cat. I love cats. When I see cats outside, I'm like, I want to feed them and take them all. So I really do like cats a lot. They are so cute to me. And then also the next thing that they were asking, I'm going to go ahead and put her headband on. This, this is the cutest thing. This is something I would wear in real life because this is my type of headband. So the next question I had is, did you have birthday parties at home or away from home? So as a child, in my family, there was a lot of October birthdays. I'm just putting a little bit of um, leave-in conditioner and water in her hair just to spruce up her curls. So we would have all the October birthdays at one time. So we'll buy one big, huge cake, and then we would have everybody's name on the cake which was a lot of names on the cake because in october it was my mother's birthday my birthday my uncle's birthday two three of my cousin's birthdays it was a lot and i had uh, two uncles it was two of my uncles two of my mom's brother's birthday and then three of my cousins so october was a very busy birthday month so we will always have the birthday together and in my dad's family, so they would do something separate for me sometimes for my birthday. Since in that family, they didn't really have October babies. So the next question that they have was... Well, the next question they had was, do you collect more than just dolls as a kid? And absolutely. Even now, like some people, they'll find out if it's you come to my house that I collect Hot Wheels. So I do have Hot Wheels because I am a cars girl. So I'll collect like the little Hot Wheel cars that I'll see in the stores. And I love Barbie cars. I have like a lot of Barbie cars. I think I have over about nine Barbie cars. Yeah, I think I have about nine Barbie cars, which are really cute because I love it for my doll photography. So I do have about eight Barbie cars. And then Hot Wheel cars, I have some of the Barbie ones. I'm looking for the new pink one. And then also I'm looking for 
um there's also another rare one that's white for new barbie extra car so yeah i did collect more than just barbie i did also like hot wheels and then also i did like toy story toys i did used to like that and then I also used to like Legos when I was younger. I was really into Legos. And then I also used to collect tea, tea sets. Cause it's funny story, when I was born, this lady before I was born, she gave my mom a tea set for me before she passed away. And it was funny cause after that, like I was obsessed with tea parties with my sister and tea sets. And I had a butterfly tea set when I was like in my early twenties. And I have a lot of tea mugs. If I, oh, if I give you guys a tour of my kitchen, I have a cabinet full of tea mugs. And I love tea and tea mugs. And that's one of my favorite things to collect. So since I was little, I was into tea sets. So that was another thing that I used to collect. So the final question they had was, did you go on family vacations as a child? Absolutely. So I, like I said, I'm one of 11 grandchildren and my grandparents, every summer took us to alabama we would always get in the rv and go to alabama and that and also disney we would all pack up and go to disney since i was a little girl i have pictures of me lined up with my cousins at disney and it, it was a good time it was a good time it was a lot of us you know but it was a really good time and i remember it like it was yesterday so yeah we did do family vacations. I like to vacation now. I haven't vacationed post COVID, but I do love to go to Disney. I'm a Disney girly. I, we used to have the annual pass cause I live in Florida, I live in Miami, Florida. And yeah, so I love vacations. I've been to Colorado, I've been to Las Vegas. I love vacationing, but with my family, we used to always go to visit immediate family for a vacation. So yeah, so those are the 12 questions that they have for their tie. And little Mia is dressed for the day. You guys see her little outfit, her little socks, so cute. So she's dressed up for the weekend. And I love her earrings, I did pierce her ears. Let me show you guys, cause you could probably see her ears. So I did pierce her ears here. And then she has her ears pierced right here. So she's so cute. I love her hair. I love dolls with hair. Like ever since I was little, I always loved dolls with hair. And her sibling has, is gonna have a lot of hair. So let me know what your answers are and tag them if you guys plan on joining their tag today for our Rebar Money tag. Okay guys, so that's all the questions. And thank you guys so much for doing this tag. It was so much fun to answer all these questions so everyone could get to know all of us better. So don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.